Guess who's got COVID? Me. Literally look like death. <laughs> Get a little loud in this room. I'm actually sweating, so I don't know what I'm... Oh. Sorry about that, I need to get my hair out of my face. Um, but yeah, I've got COVID and I'm basically going to vlog or what I do, which is basically nothing, like I literally don't know what to do. I've been watching, so this is my second day, I think. I don't know, my second day of quarantine. All of yesterday, I literally did nothing, I literally felt like death. Um, and then I finished a Harry Potter film and I think I've got two or three left. I've got, oh no, I've got two left, which is the Deathly Hallows part one and two. So how excited is that? It's so weird when you watch something when you're older because you understand more. It's just like, oh, I didn't know that. It just makes loads more sense. Um, like, I didn't realise that Snape, like, did a little, what do you call it? that thing <laughs> these are my best friend at the moment i literally look awful like anyway i'm gonna watch the rest of hp and then do a load of nothing probably guys i look so ugly it's actually bad but what can you do can't even blame me for looking this bad because I do have COVID, but we just had Domino's and I had one slice of pizza and I can't eat anymore. To be fair, I did have two cookies and seven chicken tippers. I'm so tired and I've got a blocked nose. It's nine o'clock and I've done nothing. I watched all of Harry Potter, so that was great. I had a Domino's and surfed at the web and that's literally all I've done. I feel like... Oh, I sold an eyeshadow palette for £2 and then looked online and seen that it was selling for £20. So, lost, <coughs> lost out on £18 there. Oh well. Oh well. She saved her money. This is what I made today two pounds on the bright side when i come out of isolation i am going away so on my 10th 11th on the 12th day which is you can only you only have to isolate for 10 now for when you get symptoms so there's a day where i have a full day of non-isolation um and then the next day after that i go away so i can't wait for that mm, let's hope everyone's well for it um and it'll just be a nice weekend away well needed in a hot tub so yeah i did oh i've just had a very good thought a very very good thought might book in my eyelashes that'll be really good Sorry. hello everyone we're on day three of isolation um last night we had Domino's had pizza each and chicken dippers and cookies and then we saved some well I didn't eat all of it so I've had some this morning and I cannot taste anything so I'm pissed about that one um I can't smell my incense or my wax melts so well up so yeah I'm well upset about that um got up this morning at like half six because I couldn't sleep and was just coughing so you know Corona is really not the one but we've been watching loads of movies um Alice in Wonderland so yeah that's what we're doing at the moment and probably a whole lot of nothing for the rest of the day I've actually had to close my blinds as well because um my eyes are really sensitive and I can't move them really quickly because it hurts so I'm just doing just great. I don't know what else to do really, and hopefully I lose some weight from this because I'm getting a lot of trouble. But yeah, I'm gonna continue watching this now. But 
I will probably update you later today or tomorrow. I tried eating soup and pizza and a tea and jelly babies. Nothing. Can't taste. Nothing. Can't smell anything. So, there's literally nothing I could do. It's only day three and I feel like I'm going insane. Oh, my neck's hurting. My eyes are really sensitive. Like, it hurts if I move them too fast. Which is basically all the time because I just move really fast. I feel like really drowsy. But I think that's because like I've just stayed in bed and not done anything. Like I'm one of them people who have to get up and go out and do something. And when I don't I just feel like drowsy all the time. So yeah. Um, I think it's day five. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, yeah, it's day five. And... I feel a lot better today, not gonna lie. I do feel a lot better. Um, I look just as bad as I did to begin with, but I feel a lot better, so that's the main thing. Um, I'm currently putting this mask on. It really makes your skin feel really good after that. It's just the Pure Clay Blemish Rescue Mask. I can't remember what brand this is, why can't I think? I feel like it's L'Oreal. But it's this one, they have like different ones. I've still got a lot of brain fog and I can't think of what I was going to say. Anyway, <laughs> I'm putting this mask on and that's all I've done. I tried to start a puzzle and I didn't even put two pieces together. That is my phone, sorry. Every time I move my phone, the camera falls. Yeah, I did try to do a puzzle and it just didn't work. So, all I've been doing is sat my bed. I attempted to change my sheets. And all I've done is change the bottom layer and then I get like distracted or bored or the energy is just not there to do it. So nothing ever gets done by myself because of that reason. But in all fairness, I am battling COVID right now. So I'm cutting myself some slack. Um, and by the way, all of it in today was like a rice bowl and I couldn't taste any of it and it was spicy. Like you can taste, you, you know it's spicy because you can feel the feeling of spice but you can't taste anything so it's proper shit. I ate half of like a brunch, like breakfast kind of bar thing. Couldn't taste it obviously. And that's it, that's all I've had. Pretty shit really, there's literally no point eating if it doesn't taste like anything. But, um... I'm probably just going to sit here for ages, forget that, about the mask, and then it'll be like 7 o'clock by the time I remember. It's currently 4 o'clock, but it's this time next week that I come out of isolation, so fingers crossed. I get everything sorted. Bye. I'm going to stand. Currently coming to you from my shower. Um, <laughs> look at the reflection. I can't. I can't look at that. Um, I've. You know what? I'm always doing ugly angles and I can't do it. I'm gonna have to do up here. I feel so much better today. I'm not 100. percent I'm more like 95. But that works for me. Um, I feel like this will be a better angle. I don't know. I literally look so awful still, can't wait to have a glow up. But yeah, I can't remember what I even done yesterday. Nothing probably, because that's all I ever do or not do. This makes me look huge. I've literally just put this top on for now. Um, yeah, I just feel, I feel better. Like I said, not 100%, but like 95%. And that's the main thing really. Um, again, I've obviously got nothing planned for today. Um, but um, there is a bright side to today. Basically, I've been locked in my whole my room and obviously my bathroom for this whole time. So that's been six days now, nearly a week. And my mum goes away. So only for like four days. But obviously because there's no one here, I can go out of my room, which is great. It's actually amazing. I can now use the rest of my house. But then I obviously have to like disinfect everything and make sure I don't cough anywhere and all that stupid stuff. I don't think I've got anything planned for later, but if I do, I will update you. 
got months and even one year. The other issue is that there is change that can happen to your taste and smell and you start smelling things differently and smell. So what can we do about that? How can we treat long-term smell loss and... Hi guys! Um, I think it's day seven today. So yeah, I'm feeling a lot better than I have been. Um, although I did wake up this morning when I thought it, my nose was like running um but then it was like i had a nosebleed basically so i was like oh okay then that's not normal i don't know why i just get really freaked out with nosebleeds so i hate them so yeah but i haven't had one since and it's been fine so i think it was just one of those things yeah so we're on day seven it's a saturday so yeah really really quite boring and sad um i'm getting out on thursday make it sound like a prison or something um but yeah i don't know I'm just really happy but i also don't really know what to do like oh i don't know it's just annoying it's one of those things like i don't have energy to do anything anyway i'm just like oh, should i should just stay indoors i probably won't do that when the time comes to it but oh, i don't know yesterday i literally had a meltdown because i couldn't taste any of my food so that was really sad um i had a chinese and i'm sure you know when you just know it it wow well, I don't know if you know. You know when you know it's just going to be a really good one. And it probably was. But I couldn't taste any of it. Apart from the feeling of spice. That's all I could like. That's the only sensation I had. Hello. Um, it's day 7 or 8. What's the, what day is it? It's Sunday today. Sunday. I can't remember what day it is. Anyway. I'm still in flipping quarantine. Isolating. Whatever you want to call it. Um... I can't eat properly like it's oh, it makes me feel really sick but it's also to do with the fact that I can't taste anything like if I could taste something it would be much better but I can't so I'm not what's the point but I've made myself <laughs> a crisp sandwich because I really fancied it but I know it's not going to taste like anything so I'm not going to enjoy it um but yeah literally keep having all these random symptoms so like i had an earache last night it's almost like my sinuses it must be blocked or whatever yeah i finally washed my hair because it was actually disgusting it's annoying really because if i had my taste i'd be okay in quarantine because in isolation even because i eat for a hobby <laughs> and when you can't taste anything you can't do that so oh it's pretty shitty but i'm getting through it and hopefully I'll be out soon. <laughs> I'm trying to convince myself that I'm not actually that ugly. It has been about two or three days since I last vlogged. And I can now say that I have not got corona. Not confidently though, because you, you, I feel like you can carry corona for a while. So maybe not completely gone. But I don't feel ill anymore i feel just i think it's because i'm inside that i feel a bit low but apart from that i'm all gucci so yeah tomorrow is wednesday and that's my last full day i'm so buzzing i just want to go out i just want to go grab food and drive and actually wake up knowing i'm gonna do something with my life even though i won't be doing much but like do you know not just staying in it's been really nice recently, like I'm kind of sweating at the moment. But it's been such lovely weather. See, so yeah, I can't wait to do that. I've already got like 13 minutes of footage already uploaded. So I'm going to keep this short and then film the last day and show you what I did myself. Which probably won't be anything exciting. Anyways, I will see you on the last day. Oh no, I won't. I'll s well, either I'll see you tomorrow or I'll see you on Thursday when I'm allowed out, so... Hey, um, I haven't got time to fully film loads of shit and yesterday I didn't film anything and I was really annoyed because now this is going to take longer and I actually have to leave my house at 12 to go away for the weekend and I need to film this, upload it and edit it and actually get it on YouTube before I go away at 12. So I haven't got a lot of time. <laughs> But um, yesterday I didn't end up filming because I forgot my camera um, 
but I ended up go literally going out from like nine o'clock to like seven <laughs> on the night because I just did not want to be at home. Um, so obviously I went to go get my lashes done tonight, but they're hybrids. They made me just look so much better. Um, anyway, I went there. Then I went to um, we went to the sunbed shop to get a little tiny tan. Um, then I went to go Costa. I went Costa with Kelsey. Um, sorry, my camera literally cut off. But um, yeah, I went to, get, went to get some food on the night. And yeah, I just stared at the whole day. So um, yeah, it was it's been a crazy vlog. I say crazy, I've literally done nothing and... I was very, very bored. But I'm out now. I'm going away for the weekend, so that's great. But thank you so much for watching if you did. Um, I was going to do like a proper, like, free day out. But I completely forgot my camera. And I just got distracted with being free. So, yeah. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you next time. Bye.